Some Galaxy S25 Ultra or Plus users are running into this frustrating issue where the Galaxy Store isn't working properly. You might see a no network available error or they're getting something went wrong while connecting to the Galaxy Store. And maybe apps just won't download or update at all. So if you're dealing with any of this, in this video we'll show you what you can try to fix this problem. Alright, so if it's showing network unavailable, this might be some internet issue. So you can start troubleshooting by swiping down your quick access panel. If you're using Wi-Fi, turn it off for 10 seconds. Just refresh the network and then turn it back on again. And if you're using mobile data, make sure you have enough data. And also make sure not to use Wi-Fi and mobile data at the same time. Similarly, what you can do is go to settings, from there to connections, to data usage, and then to allowed networks for apps, in this alphabetic list, just find out Galaxy Store, tap on it, and make sure to set it to mobile data or Wi-Fi option. If it's still not working now, just go ahead and restart your device. Sometimes this might happen for minor software glitch and a simple restart will solve it. If it's still not working, just a long press on your Galaxy Store icon. From there, go to info, scroll down for storage, and simply clear cache and then just go ahead, clear data and press delete. Although a problem should be solved after that, if it's still not working, especially when you're trying to use your mobile data, just go back to your Galaxy Stores app info, then enter Galaxy Store settings to auto update apps and make sure using Wi-Fi or mobile data option is selected. Now more often than not, this also happens for storage issues. So we're going to just open up settings on our device, scroll down for device care to storage. If you see you are running out of storage, this might happen. So go back and then enter memory. And if you want, you can just go ahead, clean up memories from your preferred apps, including Galaxy Store. And lastly, we recommend you to check for any software update available. So for that, open up settings, scroll down to software update to download and install. If any update is available, just go ahead and install it on your device. If there is no serious issue with your device, hopefully your Galaxy Store problem will be solved after that. Thanks for watching.